Well, moms know a thing or two about multitasking, don't we? Juggling kids and home and career. It's no wonder moms are so often compared to the ringmaster of a three-ring circus. GMA Life and Family contributor Lee Woodruff is going to be bringing us in-depth interviews with women who excel at that balancing act, showing us just how they do it. Well, this morning we, we begin the first installment. Patty Schialfa is muse, mom, musician, and recording artist. She's doing it all while being married to the man everybody else calls the boss, Bruce Springsteen. Lee met up with her out on tour. For nearly 16 years, New Jersey native Patty Schialfa has stood by her man, rock legend Bruce Springsteen. on a worldwide tour with the E Street Band for Springsteen's new album, Magic. I caught up with Patti Schialfa, a very busy songstress in her own right, backstage in Boston, Massachusetts. Favorite thing I've ever read about you? That you've had that moment on stage oh. playing guitar and thinking, oh, I forgot to tell the sitter about the 5.30 yeah. piano lesson. Yeah. That was my yeah. aha moment where you realize that every woman has the same experience. Doesn't matter if you're a rock star yeah. well, or you're you know, home peeling the potatoes. You've all been I've had more than one of those and, I, and you shouldn't be thinking while you're on stage. <laughs> you should be playing and not thinking. Here's this woman that wears so many hats. Your mother, your sister, your wife. And you found this place to keep yourself alive, this little flame of yours. I think you have to fight for that. And I, and I think anybody has to fight for that once you've had a, a family, your wife, like you were saying, your mother, you're trying to raise your kids. There's that whole domestic part of you which becomes very full, but then you don't want to lose your autonomy. It's who you are inside, the poetic part of you. He won me And a huge part of who Patti Schialfa has been for all of her adult life is a musician and songwriter. Schialfa's latest album, her third solo effort, Play It As It Lays, has received good reviews from critics. I get so confused, I just want to cry, 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 cry. I'm 54. I wanted to write inside my skin, inside my age. I wanted it to be womanly and very full and with the experiences that are appropriate to who I am and, and, and who I am as a woman and who I am at this age. I'm just going to Springsteen can be heard on Patty's album, backing up on the organ, guitar, and harmonica. A lot of people want to try to look into your words and read things into your relationship with Bruce. Does that kind of scrutiny make you wince? Of course there's seeds of yourself in there. Play It As It Lays for me was a song, and the album was a reflection of all this. What are the complexities of a long-term relationship? People are imperfect, they're flawed. So when you're young and you get into a relationship, you always think love holds some simplistic promise of completion. That's not true. You, how could you put that on somebody else? It's too much. You're not saying that I would. Fellow E Street bander Nils Lofgren also contributed to Play It As It Lays. Backstage in Boston, the two were doing some last minute rehearsing in her dressing room. Got shackles on my wrist. Soon I'll ship them and be gone. Seeing her here, rehearsing, interacting with the band, you see a woman who at 54 is completely comfortable with herself and the many roles that have come to define her, including wife and mother of three. Yeah. One of the things that I loved reading about was going up in your office to write, and it was like the kids have oh, an instant go, radar. You'd be trying to write, and they'd be involved in something all day, like with crayons, so intensely involved. And the second you pick up a guitar two rooms away, play one chord, Mom, <laughs> dear old little feet, what are you doing? <laughs> like I'm, I'm committing some great infidelity. <laughs> But those little kids are growing up. Their oldest child is starting to look at colleges. And Springsteen and Ski Alpha will celebrate their 16th wedding anniversary this June. What holds it together? What's the glue? We have a lot of similarities that we're lucky to have. 
as the years go on, the similarities are, are very important. Our families are very much alike. We work together and that foundation of real respect for each other, which you have to really stay vigilant. You know, you want to sink to the shrew level. <laughs> What fun! You're gonna buy the album. Now, I am gonna you? buy the yeah. album now. Yeah. yeah. And do they compete with each other? Or you know what? I'm not inside their marriage, although I'd love to be. <laughs> but um, they are the whole package. She's the whole package. She's amazing. And no, they support each other. He plays on her album. She goes on tour with him. Yeah. The kids are cute, though. She told me that the kids kind of support mommy's music because they know she's the underdog. And can you imagine Bruce going, "Hey, what about me?" Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yeah, because I mean, she's living in his shadow a little bit, but you said she's the heart she's of the family. She's the heart and soul of the family, man, like we all are. Yeah. She's amazing. Wonderful. Lee, thank you so much. What an insight.